TV. In today's video, I will be showing you how to make Nigeria fried fish roll. I already have a video of that on my YouTube channel, but someone requested for this method. The one that I uploaded there before was a big one, but in today's video, I will be showing you how to make the fried one. What I have here is fresh mackerel fish. I will be using all purpose flour, mink, nutmeg, egg, butter, baking powder, yeast, salt, onion, And uh, what I have here is a mixture of dry thyme, curry powder, ginger, garlic, salt, and seasoning powder. So the first thing to do is to boil the fish. Here is the fish on part of the fish on the pot so i'm going to add the ginger garlic pepper salt seasoning powder curry and dry thyme to so this and we have some chopped onion then water I'm going to cook this for about five minutes. Here is the fish, you can see. This is okay now. So the next thing we're going to do now is to debone the fish. The fish has been deboned, so here is the fish. What I have here is oil on fire, and we had onion. And we had the scotch bonnet and bell pepper. So, small for this. For the top of to make this fish sauce, I'm just using onion, scotch bonnet, and bell pepper. When you add this to your fish roll, it will give it a lovely taste. It makes your fish roll taste so delicious. No salt for now because I use salt to boil the fish. So there is no need for salt at this moment until I cook everything together. Now I'm going to add seasoning to it. Just a little bit. That's okay. I've already used some seasoning. Powder to boil the fish, salt, curry powder, ginger, garlic, and so So I will be adding all those ingredients for this. Just now, I will have the fish. Now, after six minutes, this fish is ready now. I will set it aside and 
proceed to the next process, which is the dough. Here is my flour. I'm using two cups of hot purpose flour. And now we have, have a teaspoon of baking powder. And there, have a teaspoon of yeast. We need this together. And we have nuts made. Have a teaspoon of nuts made. A pinch of salt. Mix all the dry ingredients together. The, the butter, rather, right we go into this. We don't need really much butter for this. So now we use my hand to mix this together. I'm going to add egg. And mix it together. We have milk. You can use water to do this. For the liquid, you can use water. Here is my dough. Very smooth. Now I'm going to cover this dough with my cling film for about 10 minutes. So that it can marinate. Now after 10 minutes, I've come back. Here is my dough. You can see. I'm going to sprinkle some flour on the surface. I need this dough. Now I'm going to roll the flat go out here. Don't really need to cut square shape on this fried fish roll, not like the big one. Oh, we have the fish. And I'll fold it. I don't know if you can see me. I need to use my finger to pinch this side first down so that it does not open when, fr when frying it. Here is our fish roll. I will just use my finger to pinch this the head together you can see this one we will not need the head to brush it before frying this so we need to roll it here is the fish roll i'm going to place this one on my tray now and then repeat same process with remaining dough and fish here are all my fish roll i finished rolling this fish roll the next thing to do is to fry this fish roll. I've already have my oil on fire. There's my oil on fire and it's hot already. I'm going to fry this fish roll on on medium heat. I 
I'll just fry three at a time. At this stage, you can see the fish oil has straight colored, so it's very brown now. I'm going to take this out of the oil and repeat the same process with the remaining fish oil. Very fish oil, finish frying everything. You can just they're looking so beautiful. I'm going to take one now and open it so that you can see how it looks. Look at this, it is perfectly cooked. Look at this. Thanks so much for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe. Click on that notification bell so that you get instant notification whenever I upload new video. Do not forget to share this video with your friends and family. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much. See you in the next video. Bye.